So this one is basically just a drone that protects you from the sun. Uh, I actually saw somebody post one of their inventions recently that was very similar where it was a, a hat where the brim would change directions depending on where the sun was or where you were looking or something. It, it was like it would change with you. Um, and it's very similar to the concept I was going to pitch. Um, I was thinking drone at first, uh, but with our current battery limitations, I don't know how feasible that would be for getting it out to the amount of people that I think need it. Uh, the, the basic concept, though, is that you have a system where something will track your location relative to you, not globally or GPS, uh, and then where the sun is, and then place some sort of protective shielding barrier between you and the sun while you're doing labor or work outside. Um, one of my old roommates uh, used to do roof work and he would take his shirt off and just be up there for hours on hot days on, on the roof and he'd come back like burnt just like sunburnt doesn't <laughs> really give it justice and there's a lot of people who have careers or work in fields like that even collecting or harvesting produce in literal fields, um, these people potentially need protection from the sun. And when I brought up that he should install some sort of blanket or something to help protect them, he basically explained, you know, he's moving around on the roof and it's so windy, etc., that it's not really feasible to have any kind of cloth barrier or anything up there. And, um, and also just since he's moving around on these larger roofs you know you can't just have a giant tent or anything over them necessarily especially when you're that high up and also people don't want anything installed on there or even if it's temporary um, can, can, can draw attention so my idea was essentially a drone that would potentially I guess have a solar panel like that's the whole idea is that the sun's out and you want to protect yourself from it so it could also be used as an energy source but I don't know how long it could potentially function in terms of staying over somebody. I actually did see a variation of this where somebody used a drone to hover over them uh, with an umbrella so that it would protect them from the rain. And so it's essentially the same concept that I have, except for instead of rain, it would protect you from the sun and would be able to compensate from wherever the sun or light's coming from and then go there to block that path. Uh, I did think hard about this in terms of, since there's not much battery life, I thought instead of it flying, um, maybe it could be like a backpack type of situation where you're wearing this thing and without much electricity, it could have like poles, uh, like a, a tent pole or expandable pole that could then go up and then with not much electricity, look at the sun in relation to where you're wearing the backpack and provide the angle to best block that sun. Um, so, I mean, that's pretty much all I had written down here. Um, but, you know, I, I used I had rigged MacGyvered something up myself um, when I was at a music festival working security uh, for a free ticket. And my job at one point was to stand uh, in an open area next to a fence for five or six hours. Uh, and I, after just an hour or so of the sun just depressing on me. I had a chair, but um, I took a blanket and I tied it into um, the weaves of the fence. It was one of those chain link fences, so it had a lot of holes. It was almost all holes, so I was able to just tie four corners of a blanket and it 
then I put my chair in front of it and it essentially blocked the sun from me and I got a lot of compliments and you know people at the festival were like oh that's so smart and blah 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 and I'm like oh thanks you know I'm just trying to not burn and like I said it's a simple concept you know you want to block the sun you wear a hat or something but for a lot of people like I said my, my one roommate who was working roofs that that's not really possible and so I thought that it would be very beneficial to have some sort of autonomous system that could automatically track and protect you from those type of things.